It is one of the toughest moments in a family's life, finding out your child has cancer. But one organization is building hope for those children and their families. First and foremost, I want to thank this beautiful, amazing family for allowing us to invade your yard at 6 a.m. in the morning. Can we get a round of applause for them, please? Eric Newman, founder of Rock Solid Foundation, is building one playground at a time for children battling cancer. Today, three-year-old Zabdel Semeniego was surprised with this gift. It's been a long time since he had a day like this, outside and with people. Zabdel was diagnosed with leukemia in December of 2017. Our daughter was born five days before he was diagnosed with uh, leukemia. So since then, we have been living in the hospital. Rock Solid Foundation has partnered with Wiener Schnitzel to play it forward, building personal playgrounds for kids who are too sick to go to school or play with other kids at parks. It helps not only the child with cancer, but the, the siblings because they get to play as well and the parents get some time off and it's just a wonderful organization. The San Maniegos taking a break from the hospital were also gifted a limo ride to breakfast. We're really uh, thankful that he can make our son really happy in this tough time and I know he's gonna love it um, for years to come. <laughs> and the ride in the limo was amazing. He had a lot of fun, the music, the lights, everything was awesome. And that's exactly how Newman wants it. A cancer survivor himself, who was diagnosed at the age of three, started the foundation in 2009. When he was battling the disease, his parents were given a plaque that he now gives to other families. Um, so I'm gonna read it to you guys. It's entitled, What Cancer Cannot Do? It can't eat away peace. It can't corrode your faith kill friendship, destroy confidence, it can't silence courage, reduce eternal life, it can't shut out or cripple love, and it can't shatter hope. Cancer is so limited. And that it is. Newman is surprising two other Tucson families. Mm. Meanwhile, the San Maniego say next month is Abdel's last cycle of chemo, and so far his biopsies, well, they've come back negative, and they're hopeful, and so are we. Well, yeah, that's such a positive uh, future for that youngster and wow what a program and seeing the man Newman himself right. Eric Newman knowing that he survived cancer he had liver cancer mm -hmm. and now he's he's doing well there's hope yeah exactly right